Hi, welcome to Blue Baron Carpet Cleaning Systems here in Lakanto, Florida, home of the Access Point Heat Exchangers and the Blue Baron Truck Mounts. And here we have a ready to go Access Point Heat Exchanger, 3,500 pounds, ready to go in the undercarriage of that Compact 45. And one thing I wanted to say is that we can adapt any situation for your undercarriage or over the frame, any type of bracket that you need. It's all 316 stainless with 3 8 elongated holes, allows a little bit of swagger. Uh, but we can build brackets that will fit your undercarriage or if you've got a, a, a mounting plate, we put our flat bar at the bottom so that is to be able to mount down to a flat plate. Also, our inlet for our water supply comes in on either side. Cold can be either hot or cold. It comes in on the inlet side. This is where your exhaust comes in. It travels through the coils. There is 80 feet of parallel coils. That's part of our patented design. A little bit of residuality. Okay, so it comes in, lingers a little bit, and then comes out through the exit. So what we have here, you know, we've been doing this for a long time. We're a 19-year builder of the Blue Baron truck mounts and access point heat exchangers. We're number one in the industry. Look us up on Google. Uh, we're also on Google Patents, and you'll see uh, the wonderful design that we use in order to implement uh, higher heat and exposure to the heat gases. Also, the same artwork can be used for coolant and as well as discharge air from your blower, friction, heat. Uh, that would come from your blower, but predominantly most of it is heat exhaust and coolant, especially for the uh, 4.7 Hydromaster and the 1200 series of PTO Hydromaster truck mounts. So as you can see, we have a one and a half opening, which will have a one and a half pipe nipple. We'll put a one and seven eighths on this, and that one and seven eighths stainless flex will go on here with a two inch pipe clamp. Here's our header right here. We can fit Vanguard Honda we have a universal uh, uh, header that we use with a threaded piece that is just enough to turn it to the right angle because, as you know, uh, it's up and down for a lot of these uh, units that are the Honda Predator or the Vanguard. So in this case, over here, it's up and down, but we can build, and you know, because we're in the shop building this header, so we're not going to put a universal. It's going to be a a fixed standard unit with the um, going up and down with the flange. So, um, you know, we do so much with these units. We've sold so many. Oh my God, we've probably sold over 2,000 heat exchangers in the course of time. But like what we want to do is save you money and get great heat. Here we got a one and a quarter bushing to a one inch and then we have a one and a quarter. So, what I would say is that if you've got a large block engine, you're going to want to go one and a half, and then you can either go down to one and a quarter, or you can go down to one inch. So another thing I wanted to say is that we use the ball seat, because we're using the hydraulic horse, uh, hoses that are real, real strong. They're, they're 4,000 PSI rated, all steel shielding, so they're really designed for what you want, especially in where you might be going down through cutouts, you, you avoid friction and holes that might wear. So with the stainless braided hoses, I got away from them. I strictly use the 4,000 PSI rated, heavy duty, robust hoses so that you don't have any problems with breakage or leakage or anything like that. And what we use is the standard uh, U106 or 104, or the 106, this is your 3 8 Sometimes we use the 104s. And then we have the standard 3 8 ball seat uh, we use for the same connection. So this would go right on there like that. Watertight, guaranteed not to link, really nice fixtures, really nice fittings. Same here, but see this is the problem with this is we used to use this. I'm getting away from using these except for low PSI applications or chemical feed. But when it has to do with the high pressure system, we've gotten away from this. Because the 3 8 hoses, um, because of the larger Teflon area, surface area, they're only 2,200 PSI. And the quarter hoses are 3,000. But because you've expanded the size with the same thickness of Teflon, uh, you've weakened it. So we stay away from this. This is 2,200. 
That goes over there, never to be seen again as a 3 8 We're not using them on our units. We're only going to be using anything to do with high pressure, robust, steel mesh reinforced hoses. The real deal. And we want our, all our units to be robust. And we want your truck mounts too. Regardless of a Blue Baron or whatever you might have, we want your uh, units to last a long time. We want you to get incredible heat and absorption and commercial heat that you need. And if you want to spike it on the pressure system, no problem. You're not, this is not like a copper or cop, cheap copper tube and fin like so many manufacturers use. It's all heavy wall 3 8 tubing in a parallel arrangement, non-concentric layered. Heat is applied simultaneously across all the coils. There's 80 feet, 3,500 pounds pressure rated. You can't go wrong. These units can also be mounted below. Whichever way you want uh, to get this in your unit, we can make it happen for you. And also we do over the uh, web design, design work or show you a sketch as to where we think it should go. We have great customer service. We're here to help you and help you save money. Call us today at 727-505-2989 or look us up online at truckmountstore.com 24-7. Thank you.